again. I am here at the Merle Labissiere Fashion Show. I'm with one of the models, Natalie, who's modeling very, very beautiful design. Completely, completely couture all the way. Um, how do you feel about modeling in the show tonight? I love it. I like the whole artistry behind it. It's very exhibit-like, very couture, something different, something fresh that Miami definitely needs, you know? Wait, what was the most um, fun part of working with Merle? The fun part, this headpiece, we actually sold on the actual lace patch today. So we all were like back there scrambling, trying to figure out how to sew. I never took a sewing class a day in my life. Failed home at. <laughs> so this was definitely the most fun part and putting it on, just the whole concept is just amazing. And were you excited about the design? Yes, definitely. I seen it, I already knew what I was stepping into. I was excited to work with Merlene, no doubt. I'm here with Gio, who is one of the people who were in the who was in the audience tonight observing the fashion show. What did you think of tonight's collection? I thought the collection was great. I thought the um, the outfits was wonderful. The models was great, modeling the outfits as well too. Um, the cuts of the outfit, I was I was very, very, you know, captivated by some of the outfits that was worn today. Um, I can see that, you know, being sold in stores and stuff. So. And what was your favorite piece that you saw? Um, there was one, it looked like a black wedding dress. And I love that one. That was my favorite one. The one, the model that modeled it, she had the bushy hair. Loved it. That one was the best one. I'm here with John Knight, who was a performer, an artist, a musician here at the show tonight. How did you feel performing here tonight? I'm a little bit overwhelmed. This was me launching a project in the making for upwards of a decade, but the last six years here in Miami, this has been my dream to officially launch a true solo project that feels complete, and this was it. And Merlin um, gave me the opportunity, fabulous designer, and she believed in me. She saw me play live. Uh, at Olympia Theater like three months ago and she s talked to me afterwards and said I need you to sing at my fashion show and I didn't know who she was and I was kind of surprised at this and I said okay I'll do it and then it turns out she's the real deal she's one of the most talented people I've ever met and she's encouraged me to take myself and my music and my belief in what I'm capable of um, to another level and so I'm just really grateful for the experience. Um, I have a show coming up at uh, Las Rosas. Um, I believe it's April 24th um, next month. I'll be a featured act there. Um, and I'm going to be doing a similar thing that I was doing here tonight. Um, and then from there on, I really, it's all about me just booking gigs, getting my face out there, and telling my story. I just want to finally show people the music that I've been working on in a silo in my apartment in my studio for literally the last three years I've just been working on these songs and trying to figure it out and this was finally the opportunity to push me off the ledge take a leap of faith and just say go out and what cooler space in terms of creative opportunity to do this literally Marlene told me she's like you have free creative liberty to do whatever you want. That's so rare in this world. Everybody's always squeezing us and giving us direction and putting us in a box. Um, and to provide a platform and a setting where I can express myself in whatever I want to come out from my heart, um, I was able to do that. And that, that brings a tear to my eye, literally. I was crying over there before, so I'm just really happy. Yeah, if, um, if you want to follow me, John Knight Solo is my Instagram, and JohnKnightSolo.com is my website. Um, I have a single coming out uh, with an EP to follow, so all my music. But in the meantime, John Knight Solo on Instagram, 
you'll be able to follow my journey and all the updates to get my upcoming album. Hello, I'm here with Leah Luisa, one of the models in tonight's gorgeous show. I love your number that you have on. How did you enjoy walking in the show tonight? I enjoyed it a lot. I really like uh, the clothes, they're very high fashion. And uh, I've also, like I've been like, you know, going to fittings for a couple weeks now and she's been working so hard. So it's really uh, an honor to showcase her work tonight. And what was your favorite design? Uh, I really like, well not only, I, I really like the shirt, but also the long flowy dresses uh, that some of the um, girls have on tonight. Beautiful. Totally agree. And how do you feel about the whole collection? I think it's very cohesive, uh, which I really like in a line. Uh, all very similar um, colors, uh, patterns, uh, materials. Um, so I really like it. And what was your favorite part with work, working with Merlene? Um, I think that she's just really hard working and very down to earth and like you kind of have like a personal connection like I could like text her and like reach out to her like you know about whatever um, and it was always like a very personal like and she was always, always really friendly so it was just fun honestly and look at what I'm wearing like you have to yeah. have fun I love it yeah <laughs> I love doing like abstract things and stuff like this yeah I definitely like it. even the makeup down to the makeup is abstract right? Right, yeah, they thought of every single detail, it's great.